friends, welcome to a new happy learning video. Have you ever wondered how plants feed? To answer this question, we need to understand Photosynthesis Photosynthesis is a process in which plants make their own food to be able to grow and develop. In order to perform photosynthesis, they need various elements. Sunlight, carbon dioxide obtained from air and water, and chlorophyll, which is a green substance that all plants have and is fundamental for performing photosynthesis, since it could not happen without it. By the way, chlorophyll is what gives all plants their green colour. But how does photosynthesis take place? Look at this plant! As you can see, its roots are anchored to the ground. And through them, the plant absorbs water and minerals in the soil. Water with minerals are transported up the stem, reaching the leaves. The leaves are full of tiny pores called stomata, which absorb carbon dioxide that the air in the surrounding contains. All this containing water, minerals and carbon dioxide is called raw sap. Now it's chlorophyll's turn! The chlorophyll in the leaves has all the necessary ingredients for photosynthesis to take place. And when it receives sunlight, the process begins by transforming the raw sap into elaborated sap, which also circulates around the plant and works as food. All plants feed from elaborated sap and they store it in their roots like a carrot or in their fruit like an apple or a pear. Now we know how photosynthesis takes place but why is it so important? Without plants there would be no life on earth. We wouldn't have oxygen to breathe or food to feed on. You already know that herbivores eat plants and carnivores eat herbivores. Plants are fundamental for the food chain and they are also fundamental for our respiration. Actually, when humans breathe, we turn oxygen into carbon dioxide, quite the opposite of when plants perform photosynthesis. A curious fact you need to know is that at night, because plants don't have sunlight to photosynthesize, they breathe like humans do. They take in oxygen and release carbon dioxide. Remember that! And one last thing so you understand the importance of photosynthesis. When plants absorb dirty and contaminated gases, they transform them into pure air, into oxygen. And this way, they clean the atmosphere and all nature. Plants are the best solution to fight against contamination, don't you think? Goodbye, friends, and don't forget to subscribe to Happy Learning TV.